Let's talk about igneous rock. They make up a significant portion of the Earth's crust as I talk. Igneous rocks are one of the three main types of rocks on Earth. The other two are sedimentary and metamorphic. Let's move forth. Molten rock called lava reaches the Earth's surface. And molten rock called magma is below the Earth's surface. When this molten rock material cools and becomes solid, this is when igneous rocks form. Now you know this. Rocks, rock. Let's talk about igneous rock. They make up a significant portion of the Earth's crust as I talk. Igneous rocks are one of the three main types of rocks on Earth. The other two are sedimentary and metamorphic. Let's move forth. Igneous rocks can have various textures you see, which are classified into two primary categories. Intrusive igneous rocks form below the Earth's surface. When magma cools slowly, I'm glad you've learned this. Extrusive igneous rocks form on the surface of the Earth. When lava cools quickly above the ground, of course. Rocks, rock, let's talk about igneous rock. They make up a significant portion of the Earth's crust as I talk. Igneous rocks are one of the three main types of rocks on Earth. The other two are sedimentary and metamorphic. Let's move forward. Examples of igneous rocks are what you'll learn next. Granite is the first. You've heard of this one, I bet. Then we have basalt with its fine grain texture. Obsidian and pumice are the third and fourth, I'm sure. Rocks, rock. Let's talk about igneous rock. They make up a significant portion of the Earth's crust as I talk. Igneous rocks are one of the three main types of rocks on Earth. The other two are sedimentary and metamorphic. Let's move forward. Hey, this is the founder of KLT, Matthew. I'm very excited to announce we have our first book out now. It's a coloring book of the 50 states. Get it on Amazon today. Click on the link in the description below the video. Thanks for watching KLT. Please subscribe to this channel, like our videos, and check out the KLT merch store.